game right now. I'm gonna hit the Eastern Conference first. I'm gonna talk about a couple of teams right now. Uh, let's look at Orlando. Uh, GM Otis Smith uh, broke up the team, made a couple of trades. Like the Turkaloo, Gilbert Arenas, not so much. The MVP, the inconsistencies. Uh, I feel like the team needs a little size right now. Um, what do you see Orlando in the future? Do you think they'll be making a couple of more trades? Or do you think they're gonna stand pat and think that this team can do what they have to do come playoff time? Well, there's, there's not many more trades they can make. You know, when you look at what they've got and, uh, and, 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 and kind of where they are, um, you know, they've got some, some, some pretty big contracts that they're dealing with that, that they can't move much in the open arena. There's no moving it. You know, once you got oh, no. uh, yeah, it, was, it was hard enough for Washington to move it to begin with. Uh, there's, there's, there's no moving them. Uh, Turk Lou is the same sort of situation. Even Jason Richardson, uh, you know, they, they're pretty much this is the team that they're going to have. Uh, they, they will make some tweaks. You're right about the size, especially behind Dwight Howard. They want to get another quality big man in there, and, and that's going to be a challenge there. Uh, really, their only trading pieces right now, though, are Quinn Richardson and, and Chris Duhon, and that's not going to get you, you know, too tall as far as uh, uh, getting the big guy in. But they, but they do want to get a back to big guy, and, and, and that's certainly when you look at the dynamics of the team, that's really uh, something that they need to address. Is, uh, you know, quality. They had Mark Pico Pat, and that was bad. They had to give up. But uh, now, now they're looking for that. Now, when we look at a team like Atlanta, and I know my partner can attest to this, uh, look, hey, last year I thought they were utterly disgraceful. They showed no guts in the playoffs. Joe Johnson, although he's a nice player, don't get me wrong, to me he's not a max player. I, I saw a lack of toughness. And, I mean, granted, they've done a decent job this year, but I do I see this team, especially this year, taking it to another level, can they go out there and compete with the Bostons and the Miamis of the world? I don't think so. You know, you know and really they didn't make any huge change. They changed coaches, obviously, and, and uh, they they altered their offense somewhat. But if you look at the results of all those changes, I don't think it's a big difference. You know, Joe Johnson is still having the same sorts of problems uh, that he had last year. But, you know, he's obviously a very good player in the Yeah, you know, I mean, Carmelo 
and everybody kind of being a little, a little reluctant to do what they did to the NBA, which was, you know, get involved in this long negotiation only to have it fall apart at the end, and everybody put their reneg on their face. And then, you know, nobody wants to do that. So, you know, right now, everybody is thinking, well, you know, if you want to go to New York, what am I going to do? You know, why would I get involved in negotiations with the Nuggets when I'm just going to leave the guy? So, uh, it, it's really tough for the Nuggets right now because they pretty much have one team to deal with, and it's the Knicks, and the Knicks know that. So, unless they can get another team uh, interested here, then uh, uh, the Knicks can really just make a low ball offer and, and, and get the Nuggets to take it. That's, that's kind of where things stand right now is, is the Nuggets trying to find another team to get interested, and the Knicks just sort of sit back and, and, and observing the whole process. But they'd like to have some of Anthony, they'd love to get him as soon as possible. So if they can sign him as a free agent, they're not going to try to, you know, go out and give away pieces uh, just to get him now when they can get him. 